Oh snap! Look what you got here, boys! What's going on, my PEV fam? Welcome to another video from us here at PEV Writers Club. As always, and I will always start all my videos like this, I truly hope every single one of you, your family and friends, are doing great. In today's video, I will be doing the unboxing and initial setup of my own recently purchased electric unicycle. Mmm. My own EUC. I love the sound of that. You're home now. You're home with family. I am so excited. I, I fell in love with it. It was truly, truly love a first ride with this EUCs. So, man, I'm excited to, to have this finally here. And I do want to take a quick moment to thank Rent Rights for the great customer service for them offering to send me a used unit so I can decide if at number one I like EUCs, two, if I can even learn it. Which, obviously, by my purchase, now you can tell I fell in love with it and it was truly love at first ride. I'm not gonna lie. So, let's go ahead and do this unboxing. All right, let's do this, y'all. There she is, the Gothway slash Bigode, Bigode, I don't know how to say it, RS19 High Torque or HT. So let's see, first things, I am assuming this are the pads that go on the side. Oh, by the way, please do me a favor in the comment section for you uh, EUC experts. I'm a noob in this, obviously. Is this enough to have here on the sides? I see some people sometimes, they put some sort of special pads. I don't know if it's something that you recommend for me. Remember, this is my first electric unicycle. So, will this be enough? Should I get some accessories? And what accessories do you guys recommend? I would really appreciate it. Leave me some ideas on the comments below. Thank you so much for hooking a brother out. So, here's the pads on this. Uh, the typical manual stuff, the boring parts that I call about an unboxing. Uh, I'm assuming this right here is the charger. It looks to me, yep, that's what I thought. It seems to be a very beefy looking charger. It's a 100.8 V3A. Looks pretty pretty beefy. It looks at least it looks a lot beefier than the scooters. Even the one on the 11X. So that's that. And now I'm gonna be getting this thing out. Actually, let me put this away first. Let's see what's in here. Oh boy. She looks so pretty. Oh wow. Man, I'm size 12. This, I can tell, is going to be more comfortable than the Kingston 14D I was testing out. So, I am excited to take, take this for a spin. Not today because it's raining here, but yeah, I'm going to get to know it really well. And now it's time to add the pads. Now the other side. One thing I noticed with the first one, um, and this one, it takes a little bit of work to remove this 3M paper from the other side of this, the, the pad. So be very careful, because on this one I almost ripped the whole uh, glue part, if you will. So... There goes nothing. I'll try to put it in the best position I could. So. Now a little bit of the setup and the Facebook groups, which this is why I love the Facebook groups. You get real time response from, from fellow members, people always willing to help. There's nothing but love on the Facebook groups. There are many apps and the app stores that you can, that they're supposed to help you with the EUC, but by far the best one is definitely EUC World. Um, and then I call Nathan from Red Rides and Douglas, Douglas, you're the man, brother. You're the man. Douglas helped me out uh, to finally set up because there were some beepings that I didn't understand. 
So basically to make it easier, if you have an Android device, EUC World is awesome for everything but the initial calibration you need to do. And I discovered that the Gathaway or Bigotti has their own app, but there is not one for Android, only for iOS. So I stole my wife's iPhone, because I'm an Android guy, and basically did the calibration. Douglas helped me. I want to now show you a little bit of the uh, features on the lighting and stuff. Uh, one of the things that, again, I am keep saying this, I know uh, I'm very new to this whole thing, so I do like the King song, um, the trolley, I guess, you know, because I don't know how I feel about having this on the back. I guess it's fine. It's just a preference thing in the middle. I don't know. I find it more comfortable to move it like a suitcase, but I guess this, this can work as well. So at, at first, this was really hard to uh, make it release completely out. So just, just a little pointer there, as you can see, you kind of have to tap it there. So goes down. Now I just wanted to show you a little bit of the rear lights. Power the sucker up. I actually love this. Um, I don't know how many EUCs they have the rear light, but this is pretty cool that you can have the lighting on the back as well. Let's see if we can turn it. You can see the front lighting. Um, Douglas again from Red Rides helped me with this as well. Because this, by the way, was nowhere to be found on the, the user manual, so to me the user manual was garbage. So, three tabs, one, two, three, it goes through the light cycle. So here you have the rainbow lights, three, switching, it's like if you want it blinking, one, two, three goes off if you don't want any lights and it does the same thing on the back but the stop light still stays on red one two three now you go with that color one two three one two three one two three and this is my favorite setup because I like I like the LED lights on the front in white for like you know like uh, running daylights and you will see on the back they're also in red, so the way it should be. Like, at least I like it that way. I'm kind of picky how I like stuff, so... And then if you just want to turn your light on... PSA right now, the next option is a strobe light. So I just want to show you for the purpose of the video, I'm not trying to give you a migraine. So you can see that. Those are the features of the buttons. If you count the three, again, it's going to go back and cycle all the lights until you find the configuration you like, I guess. Now to the last part of this unboxing slash setup video of the RS19 HT, which is the sound system. Get ready for some grooving, baby fam. Let's see how that goes. Not too bad. Battery, 99%. Still the battery. 28%. I'm make you go Five minutes from start. I'm original, and I told you so. Sound here on the back. So, with a little under the cure, I'm available. If you want to find me, find the chair. What do you think? Coming, you're gonna wanna take a red eye. Sounds pretty good to it's me. Time to go. It's time to go. Peace out, peace.